Hey everyone, welcome back and today we will be doing another lead code 501 find the mode in binary search tree an easy one given the root of the binary search tree return all the modes the most frequently occurred element in it and that's it just return the most frequently occurred element in it and let's get started so if root if there is not root to begin with we will just return our empty list just return our empty list and if there is no root to the left and not a root to the right we can just return in this case root value because root is the only node at this point present in our you can say the binary search tree making a function which will check the duplicates for us so check the dupes for us and passing it our root like this and also calling it so check dupes will be having root okay so we'll be making a map uh, which will be just taking the counts so count will be a dictionary and that's it so next let's write our function so if root value is not in our count map it means it, it is a new value so what we will do is just uh, just use that value and assign it one because it was the first time it was uh, seen in our binary search tree and it if it was already there we will just add one at each point every time we see it so if not root left if there is not a root to the left and not a root to the very right then what we'll be doing is just returning at this point and if there is a root to the left we will call the function again and passing it our root to the left and doing the same with the right side if root to the right is present then check dupes will be passing it the right side okay we are done with our function let me see yes we are done with our function now we will be making an, a result output list and a maximum number you can say a maximum count count which will have the maximum of the count values okay like this and for every key and value in our count items count items we will iterate through it and if a value at certain point becomes equal to the maximum count then we know that it is a maximum value so we will just append it to our uh, the key because we will be just returning the key and that's it and just return the result after all of this and let's see if this works and this works and that's it 